They go down the short side. Joe with ball in hand. Dummies goes herself. She's going to score. Great try. Great try. Very smart play, but it all just came from those offloads and just uh, from their big forwards and playing a bit. And here we go. And again on replay, you can see Melly Joe just keeping the ball out in two hands, throwing the big dummy. The Guri has uh, scrambled and numbered up. Fifth tackle option here. Ball comes out to Melly Joe. They've got an uh, overlap oh, on the vision, sideline. Good catch and pass here. Great vision from Melly Joe. What a try, Melly Joe getting the ball away to his centre. Replay, you can see just Melly Joe with that vision. I think the wingers dropped back for the kick. She kept the ball alive and eventually getting the ball away to uh, her outside players who found Kunjil. Barnstorming uh, run there about 20 metres out. As soon as she had the ball in hand, she had the speed and the strength. Oh. Good step there from uh, Tasha Storm as she gets the offload away. Sa, she's got options outside. Looks like she's going to go herself Great and score try. here. <laughs> what a try to Louise Sa. The Hagen Eagles picking up where they left off in the first half. And coming so there's our footwork, break and tackle, offload, and just great awareness. Yeah, good uh, heads up footy there from uh, the playmakers, especially the, the, the spine this afternoon shining for uh, the Hagen Eagles. Saad looks like she's gone into that uh, sort of like second 5'8", maybe playing that lock position that's uh, being revolutionized in the modern game. And uh, comes up trumps as uh, Melly Joe gets the ball here. Dummies goes herself, cutting straight through the middle. She's got players on the outside, gets the pass away to Kunjil who will score her second try of the match. And again, did yep. some work to get up and catch that ball, but uh, all the damage was already done. She just had to fall over the line. Yeah, Leon, just, just the line of defense. You can see a couple of players just shooting out of the line, creating a gap for her. For um, and it just goes back to communication and, and you know, f coming up together. Yeah, Rex on the touchline. How did you see that one play out? Yeah, Kunjil getting a third try this afternoon. The Hagen Eagles now inflicting more pain on the Guriers. They've also controlled that rock space and speed, and they score a great try. As the conversion is successful, 22 points to nil. Melly Joe now, dummies, turns it back on the inside to a barnstorming cap as she uh, gets the offload away again. Sa standing in the tackle. Offloads coming thick and fast. Melly Joe with the ball in hand again. Dummy, dummy, going herself. Kunjil down the touchline. Can she get four? It looks like she's got four tries this afternoon, Kunjil. And again, the Melly Joe and Kunjil show. The Hagen Eagles, 26 points to nil. They've, they've still got some tackles under, uh, under the sleeves here as Matau gets the ball away. Ball being passed and kept alive now. Kipang, Kipa, sorry, gets the ball out to uh, Taravuna. Ball's being passed back to Kipa. She's going to score here for the Guriers, eventually putting the ball down in front of the referee who points to the spot, no questions asked. It's, it's building blocks at the moment for, for many of these uh, franchises and also uh, many of the players. 